Hey everybody, Kyle Goat here from GoatFromReviews.com on the Goat From Reviews YouTube channel. Uh, it is late at night here. It is rainy, it is stormy, but I just got out of Reed Carolyn and Channing Tatum's dog. Uh, Channing Tatum co-directed the film and starred in it. Uh, pretty general plot synopsis. Uh, he plays a former ranger who takes a ranger dog, uh, an incredibly anxiety-induced dog, one that can't be handled. He takes the dog to its owner's funeral uh, and they, they begin to grow uh, closer through their bond of mutual trauma. It's it's a really heartwarming, solid tale. I mean, everybody likes a, a, a cute story of a man and the dog who get to know each other, and and I think it has a lot to say about uh, about shared trauma and and kind of how it applies to more than just the the animal or more than just the humans in our lives, but the animals who embark on the journey with the humans. Um, there's a lot of great things about this movie. I really, really enjoyed it, uh, but there are also some really odd choices in the narrative structure that kind of were like, it's really weird to have that. Like there's there's a moment where uh, he, the main character uh, ends up on a pot farm with the dog and I see what they're trying to do with the, with the pot farm, like in the sense that the dog is drawn to it because it's it's been trained to sniff for drugs. Like I, I get that idea, but it's just the execution of it where like the pot farmer people are, are they play it like it's going to be an action scene, and and if we watch the trailer, we know that it's it doesn't end up being that way. And there's another part where, like he comes across like two tantric sex women, and he just he's trying to have a three way with them, but the dog's barking outside, and it's like that just I don't know. It kind of just took away from the narrative. We were so close to having this really tight uh, dramedy about that, but like some of the comedic choices in the narrative st storytelling were weird. But some of them worked really well. Like outside of those two scenes, which I felt kind of took me out of the narrative, a lot of this movie worked really well, and I was I was not surprised so much, but I was happy to see that um, Channing Tatum can do more than just be the generic action guy. And he's a really funny actor, but like seeing him flex some of his dramatic muscles here, I, I really enjoyed the movie. Um, I actually I was I was in com conversation with my father who doesn't go to movies very often he thought the movie looked exciting so I said you know what I get out of this thing I'll let you know what I feel um, and I'm, I'm going to recommend it to him and I'll recommend it to you as well so let me know down in the comment section below what you thought about Channing Tatum and Reed Carolyn's dog which just opened in theaters recently uh, give your impressions in the comment section below while you're down there go ahead and click like and subscribe it helps out these smaller channels so much and you don't even realize how much it helps out our channels plus then you'll never miss a, another episode of Kyle or of, of go from reviews uh, or any of the other uh, shows that I've currently got on this channel please do so um, and uh, hey while you're down there as well check out Kyle and Nick on film it's my sibling show we have new episodes Mondays Thursdays and Saturdays uh, where Nick Palatichuk from the St. Paul Filmcast and I get together and talk about a various film in the film verse and break it down for a good half hour uh, I really enjoy doing that show and I think you'll really enjoy watching it as well so thank you all for joining me and until next time we'll see ya